No, and this scene about Betsy Ross, uh, a playpen, a banana, and World War II will be influenced by these different playwrights and theatrical styles, as Bill Russell calls them out during the course of the scene. So we take you now to World War II. <laughs> <laughs> You got that flag there. Well, I, I'm almost finished with it. I almost I, finished. This no, is I, our fifth war. But I, <laughs> look, look. When I first started, all you wanted were 13 stars. <laughs> then you go and you go for 40. Now it's 48. What? At the end of the war, I'm after going to go. So maybe a couple more of them on. No, I guarantee 48 is top. Oh, sure, sure. I've heard that before. Look at these fingers. Oh, yeah, they're full of holes. Yeah, yeah, and look. I have never stood up for them to shoot through them either. This is Needles guy, Needles. Yeah, yeah, but look, I mean, we've been waiting for this flag an awful long time, Betsy. Listen, listen, I'll do it, I'll do it. Do you know how tired I am of hearing all the platoons going, oh, there goes the old so-and-so? I mean, come on, I don't need it. Yeah, well, I happen to be the general. You have no idea what they call me. Oh, really? What do they call you? I have no idea either. They, <laughs> they wouldn't dare say it in front of me. Huh, I'm they, the general. Well, maybe they can put a patent on it. <laughs> <laughs> Another line like that, and you're spending six months in the playpen. Oh, no. No, not the crib. Yeah, you're going to the crib, sweetheart. Oh, please. Please, I, I've heard about the crib. They're awful in this war. Freeze. Yeah. Continue as a play by Tennessee Williams. But if y'all come into the crib with me now... <laughs> I don't know, maybe we could... Play with my rattle. <laughs> <laughs> oh, why y'all got one? Yeah, I'm a general. I get lots of toys. Well, listen, I, now I would just sit here on this bunker. Oh, there was a bunker in one of those other wars, too. But I would sit here on this bunker, and I will sew that flag. Okay, look, you finish that flag real fast. Oh, I will. Because we got to go charge up there, and we got to go defeat the Hun. The Hun? The Hun. Okay. Sweetie. <laughs> Don't get fresh. All right. All right, you get sewing. I'll just, I'll just check out these explosive bananas. Oh. Freeze. Oscar Wilde. Bananas that explode. Yes, it's the latest thing. There's nothing quite so surprising to the enemy of one's country as to bite into a piece of fruit and have their head blown off. Oh. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. I can see where that would be rather pithy, wouldn't it? Yes. <laughs> yes. Yes, and it, I assume it will catch on after the war just for stunts and pranksters, you know the type. Yes, I see. Well, does that, do all the men have them? I mean, do you take those bananas and dole them out? Oh, no. <laughs> no, we have special commando groups disguised as, 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 as fruit sellers. Uh, Freeze. <laughs> Wagner. Then we'll take the banana. <laughs> And we'll pass them out to all the troops that be. Yes, and then when they've got them, they can defeat those Huns, even though I sort of feel bad about fighting them. Well, we must do it. Oh, come on, I will help you after I finish my flag. All right, we'll unfurl the flag and hurl our bananas. <laughs> oh, look out, you oh, Huns, we're coming the over the hill. We'll, we'll, we'll throw the we'll bananas at and you. If we will, will. Boom, 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 you will boom, be destroyed by us. Real, and you lose all, all of your appeal. Freeze, Henrik Ibsen. You take the bananas and you hand them out. Handing out bananas is woman's work. <laughs> First, we have a flag that I must sew. Yes. Then we have bananas I must pass out. Yes. I feel that maybe the general should be in the crib for he is acting like an infant. Generals don't act like infants. They're really that way. <laughs> Freeze, Harvey Firestein. Oh, come on, get in the, get in the crib. No, I'll try it on just once. <laughs> Okay, but, I, you know, I, I don't usually spend any time in cribs. Well, no, no. I mean, usually I spend my time in tanks and things like that. I, I don't feel comfortable in cribs. Give me a banana. Okay. <laughs> you know, I, I love your gold lame uniform. Do you? Do you mm -hmm. like it? Really? It's you. It's you. you it really like it? is. Freeze. Harold Pinter. Why? Why are you so interested in my uniform? <laughs> it suits you well. 
And what do you mean by that? I don't know. How come you don't know nothing? <laughs> what? <laughs> How come you don't know nothing? I've been spending all my time sewing. Freeze, William Shakespeare. And good my lord, yea, I have many a time up and down the sea mid gone. And yea, my lord, and stars I have put on till stars at night I do from these I see, and yet they not be in the sky up. <laughs> Nay, lady, and if thou wouldst not into the sky look, and that stars pluck down and onto that cloth place, then thy job would o'er be. <laughs> I do, yea, around my house with needle and thread and mayhaps cushion of pin walk. And I am a lonely person. And I do say, mayhaps, if these wars would done keep going, then yea, I would something to do have. Nay, lady, but this doth war do be the war that will all other wars end, know you not? And that once we do this banner underneath to have, then we can all the breach flow ourselves. And calling out to God and nature, God for England, Ike and St. George. <laughs> That we might they conquer, and thou couldst the credit from it get, for thou didst with thy hands make that which our hearts did follow all the front. Oh, my lord, wouldst thou that to me again say? <laughs> Nay, for this war hath already four years lasted, and another four we need not. But, my lord, what thou dost say, I couldst, yea, embroider on a flag. And when we didst up it put, we could see if people would thy words listen to, and mayhaps this war over it would be. Say you so, that the words that from this mouth I do speak, thou wouldst on that banner place? Oh, yes, my lord. And people wouldst then there read them, although when they from the other side of the flag see, they wouldst backwards be. <laughs> Jay may have like the tissue of toilet use and two ply make it. Oh, then, lady, wouldst thou for me this do? Yes, my lord. And if thou wouldst, yea, mayhaps in that crib get, thou wouldst like a young babe look, and people wouldst that face believe. Aye, then I shall in that crib be, and this face of youth shall they believe. But then, my lord. Aye, lady. In there thou shalt go, and thy words I shall put, and I know that it shall look cute. And then, my lord, we shall on the rock put it, run it up the pole and see if anyone salutes. <laughs> <laughs>